Welcome to the Precision Air Rifle Channel. We're going to do the follow-up on the Howler Slugs. I did do a couple changes. I took the pin probe and moved it back a little bit. I'm not sure what that had to do with the feed issue, but since I moved the pin probe back a little bit, my feed issue has gone down to maybe 10, 20 percent problem. I mean, it's manage manageable right now. We're going to look and see what these group now. It's a calm day. It's about 45 degrees out. There's no wind. And I've got the camera set up on the chronograph. It's just reading in meters per second. So we'll have to convert it, but you will be able to read it. And here we go. Okay, five shot group. I'm not too displeased with that group. It looks like it's maybe half inch to three quarters of an inch. Uh, I'd like to see it half inch if I can at 50 yards so that I can shoot for a one inch group at 100 yards. Uh, my velocity now is down to about 1,088. I'm on four on the hammer wheel. It seemed to bring it in a little bit. Uh, the feed, as you saw, worked real good. My feelings on the Howler slugs have changed a little bit. I'm feeling like they're not too bad. Um, you know, would I buy them? Yeah, I'd probably buy some more. Um, do I want to shoot them at 100 yards? Most definitely do I want to shoot them at 100 yards. So we're going to try. But for right now, I'm going to shoot at 50 yards only. Okay? Let's shoot one more group and see what we get. Okay, let's do another one. They're doing better. We'll go inside in a minute and we'll test out the or measure 
the groups and see how we did. Um, I may shoot the last target and see what we get on the last group, because I'm curious. Okay, we're going to go inside in a minute, and we're going to take a look at what the numbers were. Uh, I was running at about 1,080 feet per second, so I did drop down approximately uh, 20 feet per second, 22. Uh, the groups looks like they've tightened up a little bit. Am I happy? I'm fairly happy. I can live with it. Uh, am I going to continue to work with it? Probably so, because I want to shoot these. I've got four tens of them, and we'll see what we get. We'll see you inside. Welcome back. We finished the shooting outside, and I wanted to wrap it up. I was pretty impressed with the slugs now, my groups were pretty good. The first group I shot real slow and deliberate and then the rest of the groups I was shooting a little bit faster pace so they opened up a little bit and I'll take the hit for that one. But nothing was over an inch. The largest I had was like 0.86 and the serious, the first group was 0.49. So I was real pleased with that. My rifle is sighted in for 30 yards so 50 yards she's gonna hit a little bit high it doesn't come back down for the second uh, sight in until 60 yards so that's why I was shooting high I didn't want to resight my rifle in I want to keep my zero at 30 yards and adjust for everything uh, the speeds were 1100 feet per second. The extreme spread was 11.39 and the standard deviation was 2.9 feet per second. So the, it's running real good. Uh, I'm sorry the chronograph didn't show up that was my fault. Uh, I forgot to turn the camera on to record it. I'll try to do better next time. Uh, that's really all I've got for you. I mean, other than I'm pleased with those Day State Howlers. I'm glad I gave them a second shot to see how they feed. I don't know what moving the pin probe back a little bit had to do with the feed issues but I did. I moved it back just a hair and my feed issues disappeared. I'm also running four on the hammer wheel. That dropped my uh, feet per second from 1100 roughly down to 1080. Still pretty fast, that's cooking, but and it's developing 53 foot-pounds of energy at the muzzle. Well, I do thank you for joining me again on this journey with the Howler Slugs. I've got four tins to shoot, so I may come back in with it again if I have some more information. But I can hardly give these slugs a thumbs up now. I would buy them. Uh, the problems were problems with me and my rifle and the harmonic tune. Once I got it settled in, I'm pleased with them. Thank you very much for joining me. Until we see you in the next video, take care.